Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are doing my cat picks my May TBR. I'm so excited. So the way that I have decided to do this is by placing treats on top of my books and that's how she's going to choose what book I should be reading because I figured that's fair for her and fair for me. We both get what we want. If you don't know, my cat's a really big foodie, so any treats, she's there for it. She's so excited. That's why she's talking so much. So the first two books I'm going to have her choose from, or between, is going to be Dance of Thieves by Mary E. Pearson and Powerless by Lauren Roberts, because these are two books that I want to read for very different reasons. This one got popular on BookTube and BookTok and stuff like that, so I want to read it, see if it's worth the hype, because I feel like some people were disappointed by it how hyped up it was and then Dance of Thieves was one that was recommended by Haley Fam, which I thought it might be good so that's why I picked it up. She said she really liked it but and I kind of trust her so we're gonna have my cat pick between these two and see what she chooses. <laughs> okay so the next two books that I want my cat to choose from is actually Light Lark by Alex Astor. And the reason for that is because, again, this is one of the really popular booktube, book talk books that came out. And I keep seeing, like, the author's TikToks and, like, everyone talks about this and then they're like, oh, the first book was super good, the second book was even better. So I have, I have no idea what the series is about. I completely got it because people were hyping it up a lot. So I definitely want to see if it's worth the hype. And then The Tearsmith, which I read the back of this and I just thought it was really, really interesting. And I saw somebody else that I follow on Instagram that has a bookstagram have this book sent to them, like as a PR thing or whatever. But I just feel like the back of it was so interesting and I definitely wanted to read it. I forgot what it's about. I could read the back right now, but you guys know me. I like to go into things blind, so I'm not going to do that. But this is the other two books that I want her to choose from. So we're going to see what she chooses. So the next two books that I want my cat to choose from is going to be by one of my favorite authors, Allie Hazelwood, and that is Bride. And I think the reason I want her to have this is because it's one of my most anticipated reads that I didn't get to last month. So I definitely want to get to it soon, as soon as possible. And I'm very scared to read this, as I've said before in like other videos, because this is not her usual genre, but I love Allie Hazelwood, so I'm hoping I love this. I'm hoping that people who hyped this up were not wrong. And then the other book I want is Flawless by Elsie Silver. I finally want to start the Chestnut Spring series because I bought the entire series and I need to read it because at this point I have never been into cowboy romance and I need to get into it so I need to know if it's my genre. Should I have bought the entire series not knowing if it was my genre? No. But we are already here so we're committing. So the next two books that I want my cat to choose from are going to be Unravel Me because I definitely want to continue the Shatter Me series and I haven't in so long and after knowing how much I love Erin now, I definitely want to continue it. I definitely want to get more into it. I'm expecting a lot of more twists and turns and I feel like I'm not there yet and I really want to get there and I know that Ignite Me is the one that people love so I definitely want to get more into this. As for the book it's against. I'm picking Caraval because I really want to start the Caraval series. I haven't, and I've read her once my Broken Heart series, so I really feel like I need to read the Caraval series, and Spectacular is coming out, so I feel like it's just a matter of time, and I just need to read it at this point. I've been taking a little too long, so I think I'm more rooting for Caraval, though, because I love Stephanie Garber, so I want to know if I'm going to love the Caraval series, so I'm hoping my cat chooses this one. So the next two books I want to choose from are from not completely different genres, just completely drastically different from each other, and that is from Volcrove with Love, which is a hockey romance, which I have never read a hockey romance. I'm not really, I haven't read a lot of sports romance, I will say that. I'm, the most romances that I've read are like multi-millionaire, billionaire romances. So that is where I've stayed so far. So I'm trying to get more into 
hockey romances and just sports romances or just different types of romances and I think this one would be a really good one to start with so this is why this is my on. As for the one it's against, it's going against Twilight. Now I really want to read the Twilight series and I have watched the movies but I feel like reading it will be different so I definitely want to start reading it because I bought the first Twilight book and I was super excited and then I still haven't read it and I know this is giving like, I don't want to say 2000s but just not, it's not giving, it's giving 2000s, okay? This was copyrighted in 2005. So I'm not too far off but it's giving 2000s and I just want to read it just to feel something. So the next two books that I'm going to have my cat choose from is going to be Six of Crows because this is literally about a group that get together to be on this super big mission and one of them is like, one is a convict with a thirst for revenge, one's a sharpshooter, one's a runaway, one's a spy, like one's a thief, like this just sounds very interesting to me and this is something I've been wanting to read and I haven't yet, as ashamed as I am to say that, I haven't. As for the book it's going against. I'm scared, but I'm putting it up there. Iron Flame, because I haven't read it yet, and I have two copies. So at this point, it needs to get read. I think I was on like chapter three or something. So I have read a couple of the chapters. It's just, I haven't gotten too far into it. And I know that there's a lot that happens within this. And at this point, I just, I need to know. No one's talking about it anymore. So I feel like I don't have any spoilers. So, but I know that people love this just as much as they love the second book. I meant the first book. So, I'm hoping, because I really liked the first book. Looking back on it, it was just okay. But I still want to read the second book just to see if I'm going to continue the series or not. Because reading the first part of this book, I was like, I'm not going to continue it. But maybe I will the further I get into it. I don't know. We'll see if this even wins. But... The last two books that I want my cat to choose from are Five Survive by Holly Jackson and I'm purely reading this just because I want to do a book recommendation video of colors and this book is yellow and I haven't read a lot of yellow books and I have yellow books on my bookshelf so this is why I want to read it. Also I did read the back of this and it, it did sound super interesting so I definitely want to read it for that reason as well but those two reasons is why this book was being put into the mix for the May TBR. As for my second book Something I have been putting off for way, way, way too long is the Harry Potter series. I finally want to read this. I haven't read it, but I have watched the movies and I feel like I just, I need to get into it. I need to dive deep and just commit to this series. And I wanted to do it for a video, but knowing how long it would take me to read this series and commit to reading this series is crazy in my head. So, well, maybe we'll just start with the first book and see where we get. Okay, so now that my cat has obviously chosen all the books, I'm just going to give them a once over and then we'll... <sighs> That'll be our TBR. I'm surprised that she kept going to the same side because I was, try I was definitely trying to veer her to the other direction, but it was not working for her. So she chose what she chose. We're going to be happy with it. I hopefully will read all of these books. So she chose Powerless by Warren Roberts. The Tear Smith, which I was really hoping for, by Aaron Doom. Flawless by Elsie Silver. Caravocal by Stephanie Garber. Twilight by Stephanie Meyer. Iron Flame by Rebecca Yaros. And lastly, Five Survive by Holly Jackson. Thank you guys so much for watching and if you liked the video, please don't forget to subscribe and comment and most importantly, like the video. <laughs> Uh, um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I read this TBR. I hope we have a wrap up this month. I hope we do all the good things that we should be doing. And I love you guys and I will see you guys in the next video. 